Okay, so some of you requested how to run um, the Harmony Hub software through BlueStacks on your PC, so I'm going to give you a quick demo of how to set that up. Um, so first, go ahead and install BlueStacks. The instructions are above. It's pretty simple to install. I'm going to open it up now. Uh, BlueStacks is basically an Android system that will run on your PC. It's usually used for playing games, but you use it for other things. Um, there's a free one by Google, Google API, but um, from what I understand, BlueStacks is, is more stable, and that's why I'm using that one. Um, as you can see here, I already have Harmony installed, but if you needed to find it or install it the first time, just click on the search button here on the top and type in Harmony. Um, here you'll see it's already finding it, but if you search the Play Store for Harmony, and you may have to sign in with the uh, Google account to get to it. Um, if you don't have Android already, um, just go ahead and sign up for any Google account and you can go get to it. It's a free app, so it won't cost you anything, but it allows you to get to this. If you click on Harmony, mine's already installed. If it wasn't installed, it would say install here or open. Uh, so I'm just going to click open right here, which is the same as clicking it open in the beginning. So this will bring you to this screen. Um, so the one thing I find is a little annoying on this is that it will not automatically find your hubs on your network. So you kind of got to let this run through for a second. Uh, see if I can do this. Do begin setup. Go back. Go back. I guess I got to let this run through. I will letting this run for a second. Apologies here. Uh, while it's running, I can show you, you're going to need to go into your router to find out your IP address if you don't know the IP address for your router for your Harmony Hub already. Sorry, a little cut over here. I realized that I was showing you some of my internal network information that I wish to not show up there. In any case, I wanted to show you if you have a network map. I have an Asus RTAC 66R router. Um, other routers work very similarly. If you can get to your network map, you can see a list of all your IP addresses. This is useful when you have to do the enter the IP address manually. Um, you'll see Harmony Hub is listed here. That's the first one, which happens to not be the one I want to control. If you have more than one Harmony Hub, it will not show up as Harmony Hub is, is the name here. Um, this one you can see is made by Slim Devices. So if you look for another item that has Slim Devices, this is not. Um, but this one is. You can see that's the second uh, router I want. And then you just kind of remember that IP address. And then you can go back to your other part. And then you hit um, Advanced Scan and enter IP address manually. And then you can just type it in here. 192.168. Dot one dot one two four. Hit connect, and it should find it. Mine is called Eric's office, the one I want to get to. And voila, you're here. You can click Watch TV, and boom, it will start it up for you. Or whatever you need to do, and this will work just like the Android app. And I don't know if you can hear my TV just clicked on, and we're off into the races. We're controlling it now. Um, that's it. If you guys have any other questions, just let me know. Thanks.